We are gathered here today to celebrate Rebecca and Brian in their lifelong commitment of love to each other. Let this day be a reminder of what your love has already accomplished and the endless possibilities as you grow together for years to come. Becca, being the oldest, was always around for a call to motivate you, to kick you in the ass when you needed it, to give you advice, to give you her old homework assignments. She's incredibly generous with her time. She's so thoughtful and she's so loyal. I'd even argue that she spreads herself a bit too thin at times for the people that she loves. It's been an extremely long time since I've wished for anything, anything more than her. If we had to wish for a brother and a partner for Becca, there's nothing more than Brian that we'd hope for. He came to my freshman year homecoming completely unannounced. I was like, why are you here? <laughs> but he came with flowers because Becca could not have been there herself, which was very sweet. That was a turning point in our relationship, if I'm going to be honest. He's fed us very good food and housed us. He even makes how late I sleep in look acceptable. <laughs> And for as good of a brother he's been to us, I know that he will be an even better husband to Becca. Or else. Oh my God, you're beautiful. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> I like it. <laughs> It's very simple. Yeah, it's been hiding. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I have been so thankful to have had a front row seat to Becca and Brian's relationship from the beginning. I have seen Becca blossom into herself with him, and I have seen Brian's world light up with her. Theirs is a love that has seemed so natural and effortless even though we all know years and years of long distance is nothing but hard. Your biggest accomplishment moving forward is going to be about your marriage. If you realize that and you understand and you always communicate and you always walk side by side and you always pick the other one up when something hasn't gone smoothly, you will be together forever. You will have the joy and love that everybody wants. This moment right now is so special. You're the most loyal and supportive person. When I've met you, I appreciated that you could talk to anyone in a room and make them feel special. And that is exactly how you make me feel every day. Each and every day, you consistently find joy in the little things in life, and you bring happy energy and you make me laugh. I know through and through, we will always have each other, and nothing makes me more happy or excited for the future to know that. Enjoying the smaller things in life with you is exactly where I want to be. And I'm so happy that we get to do that every day. Rebecca, every minute with you is exactly where I should be. I love you completely, with all of my being. And every moment with you truly makes me a better person. Becca makes him laugh just by being Becca. And it, it's something amazing to see. This guy's life is coming together so amazingly. And I've got to be there every step of the way.
When I think about ideal love, I truly think about Becca and Brian. I think about everything that they've overcome, their laughs, their triumphs, and everything in between. Their relationship is something to aspire to, and they will continue to inspire me for the rest of my life and theirs. I know you both will make each other happy for all the years to come, and we can't wait to be there with you guys along the way. <laughs> I vow to always support you, to cheer you on through all of life, and to find the fun in our days. And that most importantly, Brian, I'll always love you. I love you, Brian, forever. That was beautiful. Thank you. I promise to encourage and inspire you, to laugh with you, and to comfort you in times of struggle. I promise to love you in good times and bad, when life seems easy and when life seems hard. I promise to push your chair in and to turn off the stove when you forget. <laughs> you are my person. I trust you. I respect you. I adore you. I choose you today and tomorrow and every day after, forever. I love you. By the power vested in me by the state of Florida and your dad, Greg Connor, <laughs> I pronounce you husband and wife. Tonight, I feel like the luckiest guy in the world. I got to watch him do this with this girl who is cl clearly beautiful, cool as hell. As Craig said, she speaks three languages. I couldn't be happier for you two. You two really are the most amazing people of all time. Everybody here loves you. I'm no different. And I wish you guys the happiest life ever together. Yeah!